New flats in Teluk Blanga offered for sale in May's BTO exercise are turning out to be the most attractive among four projects that were launched last week. The four-room units there have attracted over 28 applicants per flat. Now that's despite the price tag of over $600,000 per unit. The flats are scheduled to be ready in six years. Applications close at midnight. There are 175 three- and four-room flats on offer at Teluk Blanga Beacon. Over 3,500 people have applied for the BTO. It's located on the city fringes. It's the, uh, probably the only BTO based on government plans that is uh, closest to the greater southern waterfront. So uh, buyers are actually attracted to the transformation that's going to take place in the coming years. The five-room flats at Woodlands saw four applicants for each flat. It's the same for the four-room flats in Geelang. The four- and five-room units at Tenga saw over three applicants per unit. The demand for unsold units from previous launches is also higher than last November's exercise, with nine applicants vying for each flat. That's compared to about four per flat last year. One analyst says that the growing demand for such units is a result of the longer wait for BTO projects and higher resale flat prices. In the resale market, some sellers are actually asking for higher prices, and then the flats variation uh, have yet to catch up with the selling prices. That's why there is a bit of uh, cash that the buyers need to pay above the valuation itself. Buyers who have uh, certain constraints in terms of uh, coming up with more cash will likely turn to, say, the sale of balance spread uh, to uh, have the option of taking possession of the Fed faster.